Alright guys, come on, so one to the book, we're still 56 and 340 on next gen. And Sergio Aguero is gonna be back from injury when Liverpool play Man City. <laughs> Yeah, after me, I was a bit fucking pissed off when I heard that. He just had to come back from injury on that fucking day, did he? Why could he just stay fucking injured so they had fucking Jekko up front? He's a very lazy bastard, Jekko, seriously. What a shit striker, I don't rate Jekko at all, I mean. You know, he's got his fucking tapping, but seriously, why does he have to come back now? Why does he have to come back now? I just want to see Suarez rip this shit out, man, see? I don't want fucking Aguero to fucking fist us right up the ass. Aguero fucking has hazard for Chelsea, man, see? Fuck it, now. Just scared the shit out of me. We're going to have to watch for those sneaky little bastards, seriously, because Hazard or fist is on the ass and so will Aguero if you give him the fucking opportunity. Aguero is easily in the top five players in the fucking Premier League. Behind Suarez has had a brick shit on Jay Atore. Actually that's a good fucking question. Oh you a legend top five players in the Premier because for me Suarez is fucking number one then you get Hazard then you get the brick shit on Jay Atore and then you probably say Sturridge is that he's had a fucking incredible season Sturridge and then you get fucking Aguero as well. If he weren't injured he'd be fucking up there for the amount of goals but yeah it's for me it has to be Suarez, Hazard, Jay Atore, the brick shit on you just got loot, haven't you? And fucking Sturridge and Aguero, they're my top five players in the Premier League. I remember the days when people used to say that Aguero is better than fucking Suarez. Fuck off. I have to admit, Aguero is a fucking great player. I really like him a lot, but he's not better than Suarez, is he? Let's be honest. Luis Suarez is just absolutely incredible. He's just a fucking genius. Just tell me, it's going to Aguero and Nutmeg, a fucking guy in a wheelchair like Suarez probably can. No, he fucking can. Why do you think Aguero being back for the Liverpool game? Because I'm fucking good because Aguero is absolutely sensational player. But I have to admit, I'm more worried about the Chelsea game because as I scared this shit out of me. Right, we've got spares next and a cock up, let's shoot their fucking kids. Oh, what a ball. Go on, Bartley. Turn him, son. It's only shitty Dawson. Oh, go on. Shoot, Bartley. Yes! Balotelli, Italian brick shit out. Shoot Balotelli! Yes! Balotelli again, the Italian brick shit out of an era! Oh, go on, Sterling, it's all the way, son! Go on, Sterling! Hey, referee! He was touching Sterling's ass, eh? That play must be a pedophile because Sterling looks like a little boy on this, so he must like touching get that Spurs play. I can't believe Spurs has pedophiles as players, it's a disgrace! But I don't know how. Struck the post here. Oh shit! Hey referee! Referee! Hey! Got injured himself with the half gun! That's best play just trying to attack on the brick shit on Balotelli and he fucking failed and that's why he's injured! Ah, look at this from the spares but Hey referee! Referee! I know it in the ball there! Yes! That's a fantastic win! Apparently Lukaku could be joining spares in the summer! What the fuck? Yeah, why the fuck would Chelsea let this brick shit on strong Spurs? Lukaku will be a fucking great sign for Spurs. Miles better than fucking Adebayo or fucking Soldado. Soldado won't be able to score for us a guy and go on the fucking arms or legs, seriously. That's how shit he is. Just imagine Lukaku in front of Ericsson. That's just absolutely sensational. That look up real well, those two. Why do you really think the Lukaku will possibly sign for Spurs? Because I just don't understand what the fuck Mourinho is thinking. Why would you say you're only fucking decent striker like you've got? It's a disgrace. Right, we've got Sullen next. He's just a fucking great man. Up the ass. Oh shit! Shoot Sturridge! Yes! Daniel Sturridge! Oh, he's playing to Lord Sacco again! No way! Oh, 10, Coutinho. Oh, it's beautiful, Coutinho. All the way, Coutinho. Yes, Coutinho. Oh, look at this fucking 10. How can you not say he's the next Ronaldinho? Even on this fucking game, he plays like him. Oh, it's just absolutely sensational. Oh, for fuck's sake. Hey, referee! Yes, referee! Referee, well played, referee! Give him a fucking guy for that! That is fucking play from that Sunderland player! Whoa, was that fat gun in the ground? Was that Michael Owen in 10 years? Oh, come on, Royce, you can score this! Oh, shit, I've already filled already! Shit, go, Royce! Yes, Marco Royce, you beautiful German bastard! Whoa, we have for the fucking cameraman! Oh, look at this, what a shit penalty! That was a very terrible penalty, but I still fucking scored it! Because it's Marco Royce! The whole game must have got confused by Marco Royce's face, because it's so beautiful! Shoot Barini! Yes! Nice, Seth of Minnow, whoever the fuck it is! Oh, Barini, you're such a beautiful man! 
Oh, look at his face. Look at that legendary beard. Whoa, what the fuck was Jackson Lewin then? Yes, that's a sensational win. Pepe Rain has come out and said that at the end of the season, unfortunately, he has to go back to Liverpool. How many ways are there for me to say, shut the fuck up? Yeah, shut the fuck up, Rainer. Seriously, all he's done this season is talk shit about Liverpool. I honestly can't defend Rainer anymore, the poor bastard. He's honestly jealous of some of the Belgian era. All oh, you legends know that what we've been doing ever since we got rid of fucking Rainer. Seriously, we're fucking top of the league. Would we be fucking top of the league with Rainer? We'd be fucking relegated by now with all the mistakes he fucking makes. Tell me what about Minulet, but let's be honest, he makes nowhere near as many mistakes as this cunt's made for Liverpool. So why would you let Victor Rainer send all this shit about Liverpool? Because I used to love his fucking bother, but now I can go get fucked. I got Celtic next, you should really want cause fucking chocolate factory up their ass. Oh, beautiful god, Coutinho! Shoot, Coutinho! Go on! Yes, Coutinho! Just can't fucking stop the Brazilian magician! Oh, bring Coutinho! Go on, Balotelli, son, you brick shit off! Shoot, Balotelli! Yes, Balotelli! Oh, look at this, look at the swerve on that as well! Fucking save that, son! Oh, what a ball, Balotelli! Chip him, Coutinho! Go on! Yeah. Oh, oh. oh, what a ball, Sturridge! Go on, Balotelli! Shoot, Balotelli! Yes! What a fucking goal! Balotelli, what can't he fucking do the brick shit house? Oh, look at that ball from Daniel Sturridge! What a fucking shot! It's look at that! There's no way you're saving that! Yes, that's an exceptional one! Today, Aspas came out today, he wants to leave Liverpool. I bet some people start fucking dancing when they hear that. I have to admit, Aspaz ain't fucking good enough as he, let's be honest. He looked quite decent in pre-season, but he's never been the same since he injured his fucking asshole. Seriously, he injured his fucking rectum. So yeah, he's been shit since he injured his fucking asshole. He must have been bumming fucking down in the showers back when he used to play for us. He was never going to get in the fucking vest team, was it? With Daniel Sturridge and Luis Suarez wow, absolutely kicking the shit out of teams. So he always had fucking no chance of getting in the team. But what do you let think that Aspaz saying he wants to leave at the end of the season? Because I couldn't give a fuck because Fabio bringing his legendary beard going back next season. I can't wait to have his beautiful face back at Liverpool, seriously. Oh! Fabio Barini. Right, I've got a whole set next to my fucking Snickers down the front so the past is choked to death. Go on, Sturridge. All the way, son. Shoot, Sturridge. Yes! Daniel Sturridge. Oh, look at this. What a shit goal, seriously. How did he not save that? Oh, what a ball! Go on, Barini! Yes! Fabio Barini! Oh, look at this for a volley! That is absolutely exceptional! Oh, look at Barini, his legendary beard! Such a beautiful bastard! Oh, go on, Susa! Cross it, Susa! Go on, Sturridge! Yes! Daniel Sturridge! Oh, what a ball! Shoot for me, no? Oh, oh, yes, get it! Oh, what a ball! Go for me to shoot, son! Yes! Rebel Firmino! Oh, look at this, what a shit goal! Oh, what a tackle! Hey, referee! 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 How can you book him for this? This is an absolutely exceptional tackle! Yes, that's a great one! Right, it's time to predict this weekend's matches. Man City versus Southampton, I think it's going to be a 2-2 draw. We all know the score for Man City. It's a brick shit on Jay Hatt, it? Just cannot be stopped. Who even knows the score for fucking Southampton? Let's just say that manager will come over a fucking spear. That's a left fucking score. Newcastle versus Manchester United, I think Newcastle will win 2-1. I think David Luiz is dead fucking guard genie. Or fucking anyway, with his fucking afro. It's afro power. Son. I feel any will score by fucking Mary and the goalkeeper because he's such a fucking fuck. Chelsea versus Stoke, I think Chelsea will win 3-1. I think Oscar and that sneaky little Belgian bastard has will score for Chelsea. And David Luiz will probably score a fucking bicycle kick in his own net and that's on Stoke will score. Everton versus Arsenal, I think this will be a 3-3 free -free draw. I think the big shit of Lukaku and that fucking day bastard Morella should score for Everton. And who even fucking knows will score for Arsenal. Let's just say fucking Arsenal when will come on the pitch of a fucking samurai sword. West Ham versus Liverpool, I think Liverpool will win 3-1. I think Daniel Sturridge and Luis Suarez will score. And they also think said. John Flanagan will score a fucking bicycle kick. The fuck knows will score for them. Let's just say fucking Sam Adai will fucking eat our goalkeeper. So yeah, I'm sticking with 3 1 to Liverpool. What do you think the scores will be this weekend? Make sure you let me know. But anyways, you'll have a great day and see you later.